So yes, we're going to be checking out Banner of the Spark, uh, linked rather, Banner of the Spark, sorry. Uh, we're doing this live, so uh, anybody that's watching this on the tubes, on YouTube rather, uh, please do, I do apologize for the sort of interjectures in between everything. Um, this is literally just going to get straight uploaded just because, you know, I'm kind of curious. It looks really cool. The art style is a little bit different. When, to what most people might be used to. There we go. I was like, what the heck? Alright, so we'll see how this goes. Uh, unfortunately, this is supposed to have co-op on there. It's not available for this demo, sadly. And uh, according to, as I tab out of this, um, this is supposedly going for um, a October 22, 22nd release, so in about two weeks, or early access, rather, sorry. So, let's get into it. Okay, sometime Just in the future. As humanity entered the age of AI, Earth's environment began to collapse. Technology was put in place to solve the crisis, but it was too late. Yet with humanity's regression, AI continued to evolve. Unknown to all, the first Unibot was born. It continued the work it was programmed to do and built more like it to help heal the planet. They formed the Banner of the Spark, heroes of a new era. With humanity scattered, its work had become meaningless. The one who was built to save the world decided to build a world for itself instead. A great schism formed. The banner was lost to time, and all beings built with the power of the spark were to be dismantled. With nothing in the way, it turns its attention to the remnants of humanity. Mm. Seems interesting mm -hmm. enough. Ah, yes. So many archetypes. You can make them super thin. Different. I mean, I wouldn't say it's a uh, revolutionary line, but pretty decent. Easily change stuff. Not nothing super crazy. Which is, you know, which is plenty fine. Which, I don't even need anything super crazy. So we got a good amount of hairstyle. Different. Huh. Huh. Don't know if this is like an early, early build, but. Definitely some, uh, some things. I don't even know if you're gonna be really looking at your character too much, just because it's kind of like a top-down type of thing. Huh. Oh my god, the bowl haircuts, man. Huh. 
all I gotta say is the bowler haircuts. I'm not gonna lie, as a kid growing up, I had this kind of haircut. <laughs> you know what? I think we're gonna go with the Rock Lee ha haircut. <laughs> yes, I'm Rock Lee. I'm joking, but like... can see already it needs like a demo button for like the audio yeah I have to keep clicking just to kind of like just to even get an idea uh, just to get an idea of what I want to run yes we'll rock we'll Time to run Rock Lee. Buddy, why are you on the ground? Eh, no good, no good. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Miku, let me die! Miku, ma'am, and Google Monomy by my wallet, you boo! Uh huh. Let me die. I feel like I'm playing The Sims. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, what the hell? What am I, Mega Man now? What? So you would have to give it to humans to make a dog like robot. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Oh. The next area. Okay. It looks it's a cactus. Oh, we can throw stuff? What? Oh.
Okay. or hold. Seems kind of neat. Supposedly, we're supposed to get like different weapons to check out. So, I guess this is the level for it, maybe. Interesting. Still trying to get used to it too, so that doesn't help, but I throw all those parts at people too. It's interesting. Interesting. That's it for this level, yeah? yeah okay. Moving on! Get 
east of the perspective a little bit. The nice thing about this is we got a cleave going on, so that's kind of cool. I wish the charge attacks were a little bit easier to execute. Yeah, if I had health, I'd probably be taking unnecessary damage. So it's like hard to like chain stuff. Six levels for this or something? Yeah. Ah. Yeah, 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 Sucks that you can't break that with like your regular weapon though. It's a cat pull with a log in its hand. You know what Joshua went about? A single wishy mojo soon. That was a nice little introduction. Yeah, that's the only thing is like transitioning, trying to like combo and squeeze in like some heavy attacks in there. It's a little rough. Hopefully they can uh, make that transition a little bit smoother. Like the ready up time. 
enjoy your date. This is our hideout. You know me, nobody. What the hell? Not so much on it no more than one line of beat. But me, some young. Dylan, let me die. Mobano Jeep. Oh, God, you guys are well. Leo, keep. You want to win the Buddha Joe? But you enjoy your deed. We're gonna take over some lava wall ago. You tell me, do ya? Uh huh. Oh, what? Okay, I lied. We have multiplayer, so you have to go through that tutorial thing. That is cool. I don't know to what extent we'll have multiplayer wise, but I definitely want to check this out with somebody. Let's kind of see. That is dope. I like how our arm just turns into uh, a mining tool. A road cone? Okay. Okay, yeah, I could see this being... Um, Really interesting to, to kind of like segue from. Salmon Salbot? Interesting. Carry it. Catch and collect the various robotic wildlife. What? Catch into wall mounts too. Jeez. Wow. It's fine, chat. Walkley is rocking some ore. Interesting. Come back here. What is this, picky man? It's okay. I will take them all. So yeah, this is a free demo that they released today. And I got a notification on Steam, but I was like, oh, okay, cool. I wanted to check it out finally. And it's just like, what? Let's say I'm like overwhelmed, but it's just like, dang. A build mode? Oh my god, there's a build mode. Guessing my tool is not strong enough. Damn. Be at our house. Ah. The mission board, the sparkle. 
lot of expandable stuff, it looks like. Ugh. Mix of Diablo, a mixture of something else. Uh huh. Use soul sparks to upgrade. Okay. Shopkeeper, but I wanted to check out this other stuff really quick. Mm -hmm. Solo or multiplayer? Oh. Or like little workers or something, I guess. Worker bots. At least it seems that way. I wish it was like an auto, uh, what was it, scrolling, so you don't have to keep clicking for everything. Oh my god, is that a robot cash register too? Crazy. Mm. Nickel and dime, oh my god. The names. The names are real. Ah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm guessing we're supposed to get something that'd be able to translate that maybe in the future. Actually, there's other parts. Wait a minute. Go there for the saloon. There's a saloon. There's a gallery. Is it me or this reminds me of Star oh man, Stardew Valley? <laughs> Holy crap! Diana Wagasawa, move out so go there with beep. The watch at Wood Avenue. Famous Electrolyte. Uh, uh. Daddy board. Ah. Huh. Okay. It's a little cozy.
Overshield. Slamming might be good. Of course, we would have a black character. I'm kind of curious how like the the multiplayer aspect is if it's pretty solid like um, connection wise and everything. All right, so we got our first mission. Scrap is king. Why does this feel like oh man, it's like breaker stuff. do yeah the transition to do like two lights and then like a heavy it feels like it takes it's a little cumbersome especially with like the way combat is right now wonder if this is better on a controller because I'm playing keyboard and mouse right now but but I'm having difficulty landing stuff because of the way that the, the mouse, you know, you click over here, yeah, it's classic Diablo, but, yeah. So I think we'll catch, we'll do this, and see how far we go from here. Oh, that's a trap. That couldn't have been more blatant than... with those seem to be a little off. Or as like I'm standing right next to it but it doesn't like pop up unless you're actually actively facing it. Neat level so far compared to our tutorial thing. Those are well. I mean, we had traps on the other one too, but this felt a little more. Uh, Should have probably got the healing uh, power.
At least it disables uh, the traps too. Oh, hell yeah. So we just leveled up our weapon. Oh, we have armor power-ups too? She takes hits for us, okay. That's what they mean by core, so weapons have like a certain property to them. Hey, it's Mr. Burly Man. So we went from poison to... Lead to the rescue. He's kind of cool. We're gonna go for a lago walabu. Good job, so you might you. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think I'm getting the hang of it. <laughs> Sounded like he said, Whoa, deep. Very <laughs> glowing orb. Oh. Oh, Chip and Mason. Forrest. Uh -huh. Let's say, of course, he wouldn't be near the beach. Where is this man? Oh, this is our home home. Whoa, I want to wait to boot Joe. Okay, so if you don't like it, you can always, uh...
So I'm guessing this is supposed to be coming in the near future. Saloon? Oh. No, it actually tells me where this NPC is at. Kind of figured he'd be at the... Oh. So it does show on the map. I thought it didn't. Keep, he keeps moving around. That's a thing. Apparently this is the thing, so uh to the fishes with you. Like the respawns, but it's so funny. All right, nothing mucking around here. You may know soon, indeed. Well done, very done. More fish. Osego we see more just so. The joy of Guri Damalo. Balasuji gamu jiba jibi narusa. Lady, now me where you bust a lawyer, Mujala Gid, Bamisa Neo. The lawyer will lead the logo believe. The world you will love it. More you do. The donor so yang the jomo we good. No do me do ya. No suga lo wamba do we see the woman. Now me where you bust a lawyer. No go. It's a build mode, build inventory. Okay. trees out of the way. We gotta catch that guy. Come back here. All oh, because I got stuck in a freaking cutscene. This is uh, a demo called uh, Linked uh, of the Spark. Uh, soul ass, how you doing, man? It's a, new, a, de it's a roguelike game that's kind of like a mixture of different things. It looked kind of cool. I want to check it out. So basically, uh, Earth got tore up, so we made robots go fix it, and then they got out, went out of control, and now they're uh, going after humans. But there's like. A resistance with uh, these robots, and we just joined the resistance, or whatever. I guess you want to call it. I'm just laughing. I was like, "Oh, so I'm Mega Man now." Supposedly, there's multiplayer in this, but. The 
Look at that. We got some gog looking pools over here. Well, gogs and cat pools, man. Look at that. Take a picture of that. I'm laughing. Hold on. Let me, uh. Save multiplayer. Okay. So six. So combat missions are three players only. But you can have a lobby of six. Ah, huh, interesting. Yeah, we're playing single player right now. Oh, sorry to hear that your internet is out, man. Well, hopefully, uh, this will provide some respite in between everything. I finally got caught up with, uh, Roni Kenshin. So, we are ready. We are ready for the Kyoto Inferno. Yeah, it's free on Steam right now. I don't think it's Next Fest, but it's definitely free. To check out. We've got time to spare. Looks pretty cool. It's a, uh, in certain areas, it, it feels, it can feel a little generic. But at the same time, it's like, well. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, so this is supposed to be a roguelite. So every, every run is different. Uh, seems kind of interesting. Enough. And it's supposed to be releasing later this month, too, so... So we got armor that takes hits for us. Pretty neat. Disable some of the traps, but not everything I'm seeing. Hacker man. Yeah, maybe, maybe. This is like in the future, so present day Earth is so tech screwed up. So we make robots, we make AI to try to fix the planet. And it's a little too little too late.
So yeah, pretty interesting so far. This is gonna be on the tubes for anybody that misses it anyway, so it's not... It's not the end of the world. It's funny because we have a KO streak, so I was like, what is this? Am I playing breaker games now? I wanted to try that trap. I was like, oh, that's pretty neat. Got hurt pretty bad, though. Thing went down. Oh, I had a level two, but mm. Mm. shouldn't have done that. There we go. Dang blade, I'm like, oh, buddy. But why? It's called execution. Finish him. level one thing, man. Yeah, I wish that log was down there earlier. I could have just thrown it at them. It would have been great. <laughs> uh, sure. Uh, immobilizes combots versus... Sure. Because the fighting against themselves, it's not really kicking in, so... Might as well just, let's go and do the thing. Oh. Oh, it's a healing station. Kind of neat. Hmm. 
Oh, the other one was a level one anyways. Oh, okay. Huh. missing. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. How do I get there? What's happening? Wait. Freed our friend, the Mason. Okay. Eh, not bad. Eh, let's open it, sure. I didn't need to open it, but you never know. Got a power spark, so I wonder if that's to upgrade like powers and we can swap between them all. Feels like it. <laughs> Told you, Rockley to the rescue. <laughs> I couldn't find a hairstyle, so I was like, oh, I guess we're making Rockley then. Oh man. It's definitely a little neat. Apparently, you can make your own town too. I was like, oh man. I really do feel like I'm playing The Sims while hearing it, because I was like, okay, we can turn it, we can turn down the bot dialogue or whatever. I'm like, no, let's turn it, crank it up, see how it feels. And I'm like, yeah, I feel like I'm playing The Sims now. Come back here. Come back. Yeah, pretty much. But no, it gets better. Ah, you.
It's to the fishes with you. I guess the devs do people like us were gonna do stuff like that, but I think it's really cool. Like, other, you know, you're not punished for kind of mucking around. So we can put this somewhere. And move it if we don't like where it is. Although I do wish there's an easier way to like move stuff around. Oh, I'm in the way. Of course I did. Just need a. Here, your little triangle man. You. Baby bot. Ah, oh, sunflower seeds now. Okay. And I'm okay. Hello, break train. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? Alright, let's see. Can I move this? I wanted to move this so it's a little more convenient. Even move these trees. Everybody loves trees. Rotate all the way around. Oh, they're all forward facing. Okay, all right. That's kind of cool. Did not know that. Craft decor. Oh. Honestly, I wish this was a little easier to kind of figure out. I'm pretty sure it's for context. But still, it would be nice to kind of like, hey, I can understand the robot language now. Yeah. The, I mean, binary. Right. To the mission. Also, oh, all right. Let's see. Great weapon. I think we're capped at level two stuff, anyways. So. So I don't know if it's like a, a level thing or whatever. Right. 
I heard our 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 See it's hard to keep up that KO beater when they're all spaced out too. And you're more aware of like the the traps here. It's a little hard to kind of like keep them all together if you're trying to like combo stuff like that. It's a little difficult. Mm. Okay, so you can take upgrades. I just thought, I was like, oh, why am I level one again? I'm like, oh. Okay, okay, okay. And yes, they get damaged by their own traps too, so... Need to know... Yeah, that works too. Best thing to do is just knock them away, I guess. But it doesn't seem like there's any reliable way of touching that. So, just doing the thing or just just drop them out, right? I don't know. Power boost. Power boost. Seems pretty neat so far. I want to see if the damage falls through or not. We're doing 60s. that I couldn't do. Especially with, um, all those suicide robots. Jesus. Armor's probably gonna help, but not very much. Alright, so level 3, I think we're gonna definitely see some damage output, but I should have picked up the, uh, the healing power. So we'll see how long we can go. Ooh. 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 
Operate core. Sure. Go with the extra consistent damage. Get over Karas! Oh, let's just drop down. Nice hit. Ow! Discus, man! I mean, knock off Tequila Gundam, what? <laughs> fell into my trap card. Ow. I fell into your trap card. Uh, I don't know. What is this, Contra? You don't get an S gun. Getting some nice drops, so I wonder what they do, though. Money. Money? Money. Hey, looks like, uh... What's his name? I almost said Finn, but like, uh... Character from, uh... Earthbound. Ness. <laughs> Alright. Mind you, I'm still running with the, the first power that we unlocked and yeah! I chose badly. But we survived it. Rock Lee saves the day again. <laughs> uh, it seems cool. Uh, I'm kind of, like I said, the biggest thing is I'm more curious about how the multiplayer is going to play. But, uh... Yeah, it's... Seems really neat. Demo wise. Who are we so about boy de bono do? Majala geek! Put join Majala no wedding bow! No me way you go saloy. No good yo! But yo get way no big or do why the you go dog! I know the bots look a little goofy, but I'm like, I think that's the kind of appeal and this kind the Sims style type of talking. Okay, we'll skip that for a second. Cause I need to go to not there, but here. I do not have enough. Heart drives. Okay. So yeah, I would say healing is probably the. E Easiest thing to go for. I went with AoE just because I wanted to try it and kind of regret it a little bit. But, like, it's easy to get overwhelmed here, too, so. Parts for Nickel. Alright. As tradition, it's the fishes, it's to the fishes with you, sir. Bench and light posts. I need some roads, sir. Can I get some roads? No. No. Oh, so they have. We have like a bunch of quests. Too. That's interesting. Alright. Whoa! Hey, 
It really is like Ness just needs a bat to totally fine. So he's our tinkerer. Alright, let's go find a place for him. And I guess our shopkeeper's got, like, a request that we gotta put down, so I'm like, oh, okay. Can't zoom out anymore, so... We'll have to figure out something. So yeah, the most you can rotate is this. is not too bad as far as like finding that stuff. Mm -hmm. Come back here, Ben. Starbot. You cannot escape me. No escape. So how do you craft that stuff then, I wonder? I know we're like multitasking like hard with this. Friendships. Upgrade. Tune-ups. Throw speed and distance. Wire attack combo slam. Hold on, slam. Closing the space with a damage combo starter. Ooh, or... Reel him in with extreme speed. Kind of makes sense to grab these two. Like, this is cool, but I'd rather have multiple skills than just the one skill. Oops. It actually shows you the move? Okay. Mm -hmm. Radar thing. So if we save more bots, we earn more friendship chips. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, chat. How you guys doing so far? Oh, rafting. This is a barbecue. What? Yeah, we'll build a fountain. Uh huh. I kind of figured that's why we have all those resources laying around. I 
I should move that here. I'm pretty sure at some point we're gonna have, um, yeah, we're gonna have stuff. escaped. All right, so we got that. Nichols request. Oh, it's an actual quest quest. Oh, okay. I thought it was like, oh, with a dialogue or something. All right, we're going to have to suspend this because we'll do a part two for this because uh, we're having some technical difficulties right now. But, um, say about, what is it, an hour? Well, a little over an hour in. We're doing pretty good so far. I think we're back. We had some uh, technical issues on the stream side of things, so that kind of caught my eye. Oh, we got a new outfit, some other rewards. Uh. So we have two different missions we can do here. Huh. So we can upgrade while we're in comp and thing too. So if we have enough. Oh, okay. Okay, so we can change the power too once we get it unlocked. So we only get picked one of those two mods or whatever. Okay. I get the damage anyways. Seems kind of neat. That's right, I have my super. Hmm. Okay, so I'm guessing it's supposed to be a lot faster, but I'm treating this a little bit.
Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this a little bit. Alright, I'm refill. Let's go with the mods. So yeah, yeah, this seems like a cool thing. Definitely want to check it out once uh, either A it releases and then get some multiplayer going on with that. I wonder what harder difficulties look like. That's even a thing. Like, it being on top of it? Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just laughing, I'm like, uh huh. Yeah, that's kind of weird. I'll admit. I'm gonna need some health soon. Oh man. Hmm, level up or extra damage. Let's see how that works out. I don't know if I'll feel it, but we can see. Slash him, yeah, to like grapple him. Oh. You can get a little icon too. Barbecue? 
no, you can't set yourself on fire. Thought it'd be funny, but no. As a barbecue, these are tents. Ah. Kind of neat. Hmm. That's everything. No more. Yeah, I think Triumphant Repair, that's like a regen, so that's kind of cool. We're all like... Getting that heal. Wow, dudes literally just can't just fire from across the ways through obstacles and then somehow. Discus. I mean, luckily I got a chance of getting HP back, but man. Uh, 50% chance. Oh yeah, it's like order. Yeah. I wish that was like 100%. I don't even care if it's like 5 health at a time. Man, I need it. I'm definitely feeling it. But at least we get rewards back on that too, so that's kind of cool. All right, pretty much close to two hours worth. We'll say less than, we'll say an hour and a half, right? Because we're still kind of figuring stuff out. Yeah, so I get, I can repeat that mission. Um, I could say that yeah, definitely some neat stuff about it. <coughs> Excuse me. It's a little, um, a little rough in certain areas, but I, I'm assuming this is obviously a earlier build compared to what's going to be probably early access releasing later in the month. But uh, yeah, it seems seems a little neat. Definitely be uh, some real neat, honest, good fun amongst friends, or just if you like roguelikes in general, like. I just kind of saw it as kind of like a Diablo-esque type of game anyways, with a little bit of um, 
randomness since, like, if you consider classic Diablo as the randomly generated dungeons and levels and enemies and stuff like that, um, this kind of feels in that, feels in that a little bit. But then you got the aspect of base building here, upgrading your powers, things like that. That's really neat. So, if you guys enjoy checking this thing, this thing out, because I know it's a lengthy video, it's, like I said, nearly almost two hours, although we probably, would, I would say, are probably playing within, like, an hour 30. Um, definitely don't hesitate to give me a thumbs up on that. Helps out. And uh, let me know what you guys think about this. Check out yourselves, and uh, we'll see what the future brings for the linked Beyond the Spark game that's coming out later this month. So until then, guys, I'll see you guys all in the next video. Take care.